so see all of us would be extremely loving okay it is it we would all be like saints actually but the reason why we can't be saints is because of these three reasons first is lack of resonance wo uh, you are a tidy person the other person is an untidy person uski wajah se you can't love second you judge the other person are ye kaisa hai such loud behavior you know uh, such a, uh, such a stupid value system you know because of all these reasons you just judge the person away you can't love and third when somebody does something wrong to you you can't love the person because of these three big reasons we are incapable of love otherwise we would all be saints so what is required to go beyond these three reasons ongoing discipline it's a matter of sadhana the law of love is mastered when you stick to the law of love across your life you know and once you have this discipline you yield a fantastic dividends in both personal and professional life this reminds me of a statement by werner erhard okay one of uh, my favorite philosophers is the one who is behind landmark forum okay the man behind landmark forum the one who originated landmark for even uh, raju loves that you know so i think even nihar has done that so landmark forum came from an organization called est which was started by werner erhard so werner erhard says uh being disappointed with somebody is a sure way to lose him this is a brilliant statement okay mm. being disappointed with somebody is a sure way to lose the person so what it tells you is that even in your personal life or professional life if you allow the disappointment within you to fester then you will lose the person when you lose a person then who loses you only lose you know unless mm-hmm. the person is an advantage taker or narcissist i am not discussing exceptions in normal scenarios if you are disappointed right. if you are disappointed you only lose the person you know so if you can come from love then you will not be disappointed for too long then you will not lose the person and when you don't lose the person it pays dividends personally and professionally both so the same can happen even in business you, know? you have a big problem with a client you're sure to lose the client but if you continue loving the client in spite of his limitations you will maintain the client you get this point yes yeah. so that that is how powerful this discipline of love is you know it has both personal and professional dividends